Hello Aries. This is Rosemary coming to you from Ansara Angels. This angel scope is for both Aries Sun and Aries Moon. These are your June 2014 angel answers from your Aries angel Mechida El who resides over Cardinal Fire. Aries leaves May behind with the phrase, well, that didn't go very well, did it? Feeling some disdain for those who would feel the need to over delete, over erase, or over correct mistakes made with a high hope for the month of June, bringing in the understanding energies of the planet Venus. Alas, Aries, the solar aspects will not allow this understanding with the softness hoped for. The ram has great difficulty in June with his ruling planet of Mars. This is not going to be an easy month for Aries. Fear not. Your Leo friends will be of great assistance due to their familiar loyalty. Again, the ego of the lion has been tamed in favor of the placement of the planet Saturn in the chart. This will be a side never before seen in Leonine Buddies. There will be plenty of time for Aries to temper their own rising sign aspects in June with the help of Scorpio the Scorpion and Pisces the Fish. Libra the Scales and Aquarius the Water Bear will give Aries the warnings and caveats needed to maneuver through the very hard energies of the month of June. What can be done about the restrictive energies of Saturn in the chart of the Ram this month? The trick here, Aries, is to set your own rules firmly and then follow those rules in as much of a dedicated fashion as you can muster up this month. You do not have to follow anyone else's rules, Aries. But you must follow your own rules. This is not only a moral imperative in June, but rather it is a survival imperative. Love matters will be highly flirtatious as we enter the season of summer. Be sure to have good dreams on Midsummer's Eve. June 21st is midsummer this year. This is when the night is the shortest and the day is the longest. Therefore, Aries, your dreams bleed into your physical 3D world in a very sturdy and profound way on the eve of midsummer. Carving initials into a tree for the purpose of binding you and your love will not be permitted due to city ordinances against such vandalism. All the ram need do is to allow such amorous lucid dreaming without even a nanometer of control. This posture will be very important during this season if true love is what you require for happiness. The planet Mars will outwit the planet Venus bringing more lust than love so be careful, Aries. Money matters are better than you could have hoped for, but are nowhere near what you would aspire to. This is easily a soft with the realization that your financial ventures are in good hands with those born under the moon sign of Aquarius. Here again, Leo's son is extremely proficient in assisting you to manage your financial goals. One might ponder, are the financial markets rigged? How can anyone win? You may quit. The term rigged is a certain syncopanthic litigation effort in futility areas. One must be precise if one is to deal effectively with something as ginormous as the Zilligon, 
that is the global right wing cabal. This effusive beast will not lumber or menace the face of the globe. No. More like an agile stegosaurus one finds in one's box of Frito Lay corn chips. This reptile will win with an elegant, surprised snap of a heavily spiked tail and armored spine. In other words, Aries, the markets are going from being pulverized and sifted into being birthed of the good stewardship of more stable and sober hands. The new global economy is bound to be a good venture to carry invested parties from cradle to grave in extravagant style. Health matters are grim indeed, Aries. This is easily improved with a little attention to the specific emotional details of the illness invoked. What? The ram bemoans? Emotion is the sticky flypaper that captures gluons or particles of guilt. This is the stuff of creation via the god particle, morphogenic C, that sticks to the gluons of the substance of guilt. No guilt equals no physical matter. Therefore, those who would feel guilty pull in both substance and ailment. How do we solve this conundrum? Aries, how do we solve it? How do we become rich without becoming simultaneously sick? The answer to this question is that we must allow guilt to pull in money without the rushing around of those who would seek to flatter and please incessantly. Feel the guilt that naturally comes from attaining monies, goods, possessions, etc. But resist constantly the human tendency to make up for or pay back or seek closure. Why, you ask? This is because the attempt to fix anything or help anyone is not only futile, but it makes people worse. So do as you please and then allow the guilt to create love. Then resist the ego's intention to fix the feeling of guilt, to remove the pain of guilt, rather Allow it for eternity to create eternal love and abundance. This is where the pain of the crucifixion of Jesus Christ resides and heals all wounds. Your divine tone of I am brings you through June, hoping that hope has been made anew and the mind refreshed. Thank you for watching Listening Aries, and we will see you next month.